name's Ephraim Russell. Hi. And today, I'm going to be talking about Ephraim Russell. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube subscription service. And today, I'm going to be talking about YouTube right there. But that's a good analogy of what the YouTube subscription box is for a lot of people. It's hard to understand. There's so much information coming at you all over the place. A lot of it's kind of the same, but it's different at the same time. So you choose to watch one of them and focus down on one of them instead of the others. So why even have all those other ones? If you subscribe to so many people that you can't feasibly watch all the content that is uploaded every single day into your subscription box, then you should consider unsubscribing from some people. Because in the end, it actually helps. Because looking at your subscriber count and then looking at your view count and seeing them not match up anywhere close, it doesn't feel very good. It feels actually pretty bad. Help out other creators and YouTubers by unsubscribing to them if you don't actually watch them and help the creators you watch even more by turning on notifications for the channel as seen here on mobile and well here on desktop watch watch those see how to do it turn them on do it for the people you like do it for the people that you enjoy watching. It actually does help out the creators a lot by doing that. You may think unsubscribing is such a negative thing, but in the end, it actually helps out not only the creator you're unsubscribing from that you didn't watch, because now they're one less subscriber, but that means that their view ratio is going up and closer to 100%. And it helps the people that you actually do watch because you'll be able to see their content more clearly on a daily basis. This is all something to consider. I'm not saying you have to do it. That's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I'm Ephraim Russell signing off. I'll see you next time. Now, I'll let all these people say goodbye as well. You know, just because, just to drive the point home a little bit more. You can hear, hear I'm gonna walk away now. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I'll see you next time. Bye.